hello everyone welcome back to my channel so today is the big reveal and um i'm gonna unbox what i received from the four ladies so you guys can check it out oh my god i'm so excited let's see dun 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 oh my god look at everything it's so pretty i believe this one is from rhoda and this one is from Patty. Look. Oh my gosh. You guys, I'm so excited. And then this one is from Dina. Look at her little candy cane. I wonder where she found candy canes right now. And then this one is from Tamara. So let's open Tamara's first. I'm sure everybody knows tomorrow but this is her info here in case you missed it she has such awesome videos on her youtube channel if you guys want to check her out see look at her cute little stickers that go with her little labels i want to open the tn first let me see oh my gosh This is so cute. Look at these little ribbons. I saw Patty's um, unboxing, so I kind of know like how it looks, but it's so pretty to just hold it and feel everything. Look at these little Santa tags. She has the most awesome tags ever. Look, you can do a little scene here that is so cute. Then she's got some journaling. You can add a picture here. And then the front, you can pull out these tags and add pictures, add journaling to the back. Or you can do journaling and then two pictures here. That would be cute. Everything is stitched, you guys. Okay, and then this is the inside. Look at these tags. These are awesome, huge tags. Look at this one. How pretty. And that just tucks in there. Then she's got a little pocket here. Look at this one. When I saw this on Patty's video, I was like, oh my God, that is so cute. Has a little um, card here and then this is a little tuck spot there then she's got another little tuck spot but this little guy only slips out halfway so you'd have to turn it to see if you want to put pictures but that is so cute that is such a cute idea i love that and this pretty trim and then this is the back and i believe they open yes they do let me see how cute. Look at this. My gosh, Tamara's such an awesome crafter. She has so many nice ideas. All these ladies. I was so nervous doing mine because I know the ladies would make such amazing, amazing TN. So I was like, ah, and this was my first time. I've never made a TN. Okay, then this is a little gift she gifted us. She's got the Scrap Diva um, little cookie shaker. With, and this is just so, so cute. Look at all the little flowers and this little Scrap Diva snow bow. We need to get this one. When I mean we, I mean, I need to get this one. It's so, so pretty. I love it. Thank you so much, tomorrow for that one. Um, next, I'm going to open Rhoda's. Okay, so this one is Rhoda's. And look at these cute little flowers she threw in there. These are so, so pretty. I love the little flat back pearls. Oh my God, it's a little dangle. I love these. Look at how pretty. I suck at dangles, but this is so pretty. She's got snowflakes, a little deer. Look at these clay beads, candies. This is such a pretty color. Little flowers. Oh, look at this one, you guys. How cute. And then she's got pink stars. 
um yeah it's just so pretty i love it thank you so much rhoda all right Ooh, good idea to use some of that seam binding from Hobby Lobby. So this one is Rhoda's, and she did that paper tearing in the front. And look at these um, little pocket shakers. Those are so cute. You can put a picture here and then a little journaling over here. And then she did like a tuck spot here on the side, which is such a cool idea. And she added a little card. Look at how pretty this card is. With the little hunter boots. How cute. Thank you for that card. <coughs> and then look here. We could do some journaling. You can add pictures. You can mat this side too. This is so pretty. Or you can add like three little pictures here. And then do some journaling on the side. That is so cute, and she put a little charm on there. Cute. <clears throat> and then the inside, she did a little elongated pocket on the side here, and then she added a little tag with trim. And look at this beautiful pom-pom red trim. I don't have this kind of trim. I need to purchase some of this one. And then look at this little like pocket flap here. And it opens up. Let's see. Oh, I see. Okay. Look, it's a little pocket. Oh my gosh. And then you can journal back here. And then she did more paper tearing. This is so pretty. I love how she used the letters, the letter paper. And then this is the back. Look at the back. Oh my gosh, you can add a little tag in the side. Oh, that is so cool. And it's felt Christmas trees. That is so adorable. Oh my gosh, Rhoda, this is beautiful. Next is Patty's, and I believe this one was Patty's. She has a little card. Aw, thanks for asking me to join, Patty. Oh my God, I was so excited when she asked me to join, but then, uh, then reality sunk in and I got nervous. And I was like, oh my God, these ladies are amazing crafters. Like, what the heck am I going to make? But, oh my gosh, I'm so excited to open this up. Look at her little sticker that says Merry Christmas here. Okay, so after I'm done opening everything up, I'll show you guys my cover. Um... And I still need to find a tutorial to sew them together, but I wanted to show you guys all the inserts and I wanted to open it up with you guys because this is so pretty. Look at this. This is so cute. It's a little clip that she gifted us. How cute. She used a little piece of ephemera. I believe this is a doodle bug tree. It has to be. I'm pretty sure it is. <laughs> and then she did a little charm with a little bell dangle. And this is Scrap Diva's um, a snowflake bow. It's so pretty, you guys. I need that bow in my life. And then here, she said that she didn't glue this on because we could use it as a, as a template to put whatever we'd like on there. <clears throat> and so she did like a little award banner. You could do like a little family picture here. That would be so cute. Look at how pretty. And she did the paper tearing as well. And look at these beautiful snowflakes. And she used pink pom pom trim. We all use pom pom trim, most of us ladies. All every uh, one of her requirements was to have trim, to have tuck spots. So this is really cool. I can't. Then she did this whole page layout here, and she added some pieces of ephemera, and then she did this like Polaroid, really cool um pockets here for pictures which is so awesome i was like oh my god that is so cool so i was so excited i was so excited when i was watching all the ladies videos i was like oh my gosh and those are mine i'm gonna get one of those look at this little santa 3d santa 
And then the back, she's got another pretty little, she's got a little snowman here. And look at these pink snowflakes. I love this dye. And then she's got a little snowman and she said you could, it's like a tuck spot here. So this little snowman pulls out, you can put him back in there. How cute is that? And then here she's got a whole page layout and then a little tuck spot here. <clears throat> and then she did like a little flap, like a little booklet so you can, um, Add a picture, or do some journaling. You can add a picture in the back and do your journaling inside of here. That is so, so pretty. So cute, you guys. Patty, you have to show me what kind of gold thread you use because my gold thread always tears in the sewing machine. I don't know why, but maybe my sewing machine is bad. Who knows? And she also gifted us this little, um, <clears throat> she gifted us like this little embellishment box. <sighs> Look at how cute this is. She used Scrap Diva's little die. This is Baking Sweet Memories. How cute. That is so adorable. And she gave us this little ephemera piece. How cute, huh? Just to cover the top. <clears throat> okay, and then the inside. Oh my God, you guys. I have never received... I don't think I ever received anything that Patty has created. Yeah, no. We were in a swap together once, but I didn't get lucky enough to get one of her items but this oh my gosh patty i need to look at this first this is so cute i'm totally inspired to make some of these i have so many puffy stickers look at how adorable that is and she did make a tutorial on it if you guys want to make some but i'm definitely going to make some like these they're so cute and then look at another little scrap diva bow how cute is that and i love how she um added the little paper to to decorate the box so cute and then look at this how cute is this little dangle it's a little uh snowman oh he doesn't have a face how cute look how pretty i love this big bead and then so cute i love it i love it look at how cool this is you guys she added to give it some height she added this little paper here so it gave it some height and it wasn't so low. That is such a good idea, Patty. And then look at these little doodle bug stickers. How cute. The little gingy. And then, oh my gosh, look at these. I love how she tied it with this cute little ribbon. And... Look at this ribbon clasp charm dangle. How cute is that, the little car? Oh, this ribbon is so pretty with the little tinsel end. How cute. And then on this one, I saw in her video that she said she gifted some brads, so I'm dying to see these brads. Because I always look for brads on eBay to buy like different kinds of shapes and I could never find any, but look. I always check on eBay to find different kind of brad shapes um, for the holidays. I did find some Candy King ones, but look at these. She gave us Christmas trees and Christmas lights. And I think this is an, oi. I think this is an ornament here. Oh yeah, it is. That's a cool one. How cool are those? And I love how she tied that little ribbon on the lids. Um, this one is a sequin mix. How cute is that? And then this one, she said she gifted us some charms. So let's open this one up. Oh my gosh. Look at all of these charm stars. And then look at this little heart locket, a little star, a little coffee cup. Look at, oh my God, the little pine cone, the spoon. 
look at this little lantern it's so cute okay so this was our little gift from patty <clears throat> so cute oh my god oh my gosh i'm so excited for christmas i'm excited for the holidays in general okay and then last but not least it's d okay so she gifted us a little candy cane and then in here oh that is so cool let me see she gifted us some sequin boxes these are cute d okay you got some clay sequins some of my favorite sequins ever how cute and then she gifted us look at how cute she added a little ribbon to it some sequin mix here how pretty is that and then in here let me see how cute So in here, let me see. Whoa, she gifted us a lot of ephemera. That is so sweet of you, Dee. Thank you so much for taking the time to cut this out and using all those supplies. Oh my gosh, look at this. There's just a whole bunch of ephemera pieces in here. That is so cute, look. Oh, how cute is that? Oh my gosh. And then this is the TN, I believe. Look at how cute her little bow with the bell. I love this trim. And it says to Cynthia from Dina. Merry Christmas. Oh, how cool. It's a little tag. Okay. She made like a folder. Oh my gosh. Okay. Wow. So I saw Dee's video and I was like, oh my gosh. She went all out, you guys. She used mixed media. She did a ton of tuck spots, like a lot of tuck spots. So you got a little tuck spot here. She did snowflakes and a whole bunch of just oh my god look at this felt flower oh it's a little like a like a bookmark that is so cute and then she did little layering with trim here that is so cool and then this side oh my gosh look at all these ephemera pieces look oh my gosh i use some of these ephemera pieces too i'm gonna i'm gonna take out all the ephemera pieces so you guys can see the whole layout but look she stitched around she did that tear uh paper tear but she used them as pockets that was really cool oh yeah this tiny wee little tag look at the eyelet i think it's an eyelet and then look she sewed this bow here and she did some um what is it called a little shaker pocket here which is so so cute she's got all these ephemera pieces in the pockets this one these and those how cute is that and then she did another little tuck spot on the other side and she did a little pocket and let me see she used some trim here oh let me see okay come on look at this cute little calendar i love this you can totally stamp it with something or hole punch it i have these cool hole punchers let me see not hole punchers i have this punch and you could just punch it for that day and put it like in your uh layout and punch it on the day that it's for if I can reach. Okay, it either have to be at the beginning or the end because these little punches are tiny. Or maybe on the sides. Yeah, I could get to the sides. <laughs> okay, so you get my point, but that is so cute. I love this. She's got tons of just little ephemera pieces for you to add to your um, TN. So, so cute. 
Look at this ribbon, how pretty this ribbon is. And then this one. How pretty. She's got a little pocket up at the top and then she's got a side pocket too. Let me see. Come on. Oh, there we go. Look at mid one. And then she's got another little tuck spot here. See the little tuck spots? Those are so cool, right? And then she said she added a little pocket page to the middle. She said this one was sealed, but that you can add to these three here, which was so, so cute. And then this one, she's got a little tuck spot here. And then you can add pictures here if you'd like. And then you can add pictures here. You can add pictures here. Look at how pretty this paper clip is. And then you can do a little layout in the back. And look at all these trims. So pretty. And in the back, oh, she gifted us a little uh, sticker sheet. That is so cute. And then this is the back. She did more ephemera pieces. Look at that little Santa and then she did a tuck spot up here she made two pockets for you to be able to add whatever you'd like wait oh I see she made one pocket one pocket <laughs> that is so cool and then you can journal here and then here she said she added like little pieces of ephemera. So let's see what's in here. Oh, how cute is that? Ho, ho, ho. So cute. And then she added a bunch of sentiments, she said, right here. So we just got a whole heap of sentiments. The cool thing is that you can add whatever you'd like in these little pockets after, which would be so adorable. How cute. And then we have another piece of vellum here. Look at this little dangle here. How cute is this? It's held down with one of those little paper clips, the little light bulb paper clips. That's what I call them. I don't know the exact name, but how cute. I love that. So, so cute. Now time to show you guys my cover, which I think I might have to make another one, but I really don't want to, but it might be a little chunky. So I might have to make another one. Um, so this was my cover that I made. <laughs> and you know what? After I thought about it, I was like, dang, I should have added um like a spine, like a thicker spine. But uh, I had already cut it. This is my cover. And I wanted to add 2022, but I don't have any thicker. So I'm going to have to go buy a pack to add 2022. Um, but how cute is this? I really love it. And then this was my side cover, which I did like little, um, I made like little, like a little light thing here. And I added this Joanne's tool that we got last year. I really wanted to use it. And so my TN insert, it's not the same as the girls. I tried my best, but since I had a little bit of paper, I did the girls first and then whatever was left over, I figured out for myself. So the front page is pretty much exactly the same. <laughs> and then this was the side full layout. And then um, I did these two pockets here because I did one pocket for them here and then another one here. So I, I pretty much did the same thing. And then the back side, I didn't have enough to do a um, a pocket here. So I just did one pocket here. And then I put my little, my pocket thing on the side. And then this was supposed to be my back uh, piece. But um, now that I'm looking at it, I'm not sure that all of them are going to fit. 
so I might need to just make a bigger cover um see see if I could um yeah see that is chunky and I haven't even put D's in there <laughs> let me see D's so right here that is the middle of her page oh my god um sewing it might make it a little bit more compact but I need to definitely I might just make like a hard like a book cover um out of chipboard and then just sew it to the inside of that that would be kind of cool huh and then maybe i could unsew this top part i don't know i'll figure it out but isn't it so pretty these ladies put their all into this and this is amazing i just love every single tn so so pretty thank you ladies for asking me to join and being so lovely and i'm so excited to add my pictures to this for this year and then this is my insert and this is my cover <laughs> so that is our tns you guys the extra little gifts the lady sent us and Oh, so so pretty i cannot wait to put this together and add my pictures and yeah thank you you guys so much for watching if you've been watching we've been doing this hop for this whole month of july and today is july 30th but i still have christmas um one last christmas project that i want to share with you guys i might do like a craft with me but i just take so long crafting so i might do that and i might try to like smash it all together for you guys but yep thank you so much for watching guys patty thank you for hosting and inviting me ladies thank you it was so nice talking to you guys in the combo but i will catch you guys on the next video bye